Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you all are having a great day today. Um, I'm gonna go over a topic today that a lot of people go through and I wanna definitely help people out if I can. All my vlogs I do in the car are usually something that I've experienced, went through, or I'm going through at the moment. And it's all relevant to my life here. It's not just random stuff I'm talking about. And this video is gonna be multiple topics, but it's number one, it's gonna be to live your life honestly to the fullest. Yeah, that sounds very cliche to say that, but something happened recently that really opened my eyes and it really opened a perspective for me to really appreciate the people around me. Friends, family, any of your loved ones, how to really appreciate them and know what you have in front of you. A lot of people take what they have for granted and honestly, in a flash, everything can change. One day you might have something, the next day you might not and Honestly, you have to appreciate and like know what you have and Everyone gets dealt a different set of cards and whatever you're given you have to make the best of it even if it's from a job or Just a, a relationships anything it is everyone goes through hard times, but either way You have one life to live here and you have to make the best of it you have to live your life to the fullest and appreciate everyone around you because like I said if you don't live life to the fullest anything can happen things can change in an instant and life is really really short if you think about it I mean when you're young life goes really slow because the years are slow but as you get older and I'm 24 right now and I'm pretty young but as I'm getting older I notice the years are flying by and something happened recently where I just want to like just thank everyone that guided me throughout my life that were there for me the people that are here now for me the people that helped support and build myself up to the person I am today and I appreciate uh, my parents my loved ones my girlfriend every everyone that's here for me I appreciate that and I, I need everyone to honestly know what they have in front of them and I have so many people there's so much hatred out in the world where people will have a grudge towards someone they love and all of a sudden they're not there anymore something happens and all of a sudden it's just you don't have a chance to do anything. And you have to appreciate what you have in front of you. And like I said, never know what's gonna happen. I want everyone to know that no matter what, you have a support system. Everyone goes through bad things from losing a job, for example, having or getting out of, of, of a relationship, or even as bad or on the other spectrum of the scale of losing a loved one when you go through these things at the time things, things seem helpless but if you have those close one, those close loved ones always loved ones close to you and you have that support you can get through anything and any pain or suffering you go through honestly it's always gonna be there especially that stuff that's really intense that especially like losing a loved one or something intense happens in your life it's gonna hurt, it is. But you have to know that people are there for you. And over time, time heals everything, it really does. And I know this video is out there right now, but I really wanna emphasize on appreciating what you have in front of you and honestly just living your life to the fullest. If you're not enjoying your job, honestly, I'm not saying go quit your job if you don't like it. Find a way to make it better. Find a way to better yourself. Find a way to appreciate the people around you to enjoy life so much better. Honestly, people go through their day as like day-to-day -day things. They just wake up, go to work, go off, same routine over and over. And if you love your life and people are living their lives to the fullest, that is phenomenal and you're doing it right. But there's people that just wake up to do the routine and they hate it. And honestly, by doing that, that's not living. If you're not happy with what you're doing and you're not trying to change it, are you really living? Personally, I don't think so. Honestly, yeah, yeah, 
little sacrifices you have to make to eventually get to your desired goal. Nothing's gonna happen fast. Um, you have to work for whatever you do. But either way, know who's there for you. Keep the people that support you, that are close to you, that build you up close. Keep the negativity away. People that are negative, that don't believe in what you're doing, for example, anything, a job, um, doing a YouTube channel, people that don't believe in you, you don't need that negativity because if you put your mind to anything, honestly, anything's possible. And you need those positive people in your life, those people that make a huge impact. If they're there now, or even if they're not there anymore in your life, know what they did for you. Remember the good times you had with them. Know what they've given to you, okay? And I hope this video made sense to anyone here. And it's pretty straightforward. Just appreciate what you have. Live your life to the fullest. And keep your loved ones close. Close. Sorry. If you keep your loved ones close, keep the positivity around. Live your life to the fullest. I guarantee you, you'll truly be living. And honestly, my mindset has changed dramatically on this past year. And something happened recently that really changed my perspective on life, considering how short it is and how you have to make the best of it and really care for the ones around you. Because honestly, like I said, in a flash, anything can happen. You can lose someone, you can lose a job, and I don't know, anything can happen. So I hope you all are all having a great day today. Um, I know this is a short video, really random, but I, all have, I hope you all have a great day today. Um, I'm going to a car meet very soon, another huge car event. Um, I'll post more content soon. I hope you have a great day and I'll talk to you guys later.